and welcome to Transformational Talk. If you're joining me for the very first time, this week I'm doing it a little bit different. I have my kids with me just because it makes it a whole lot easier. Uh, trying to record in a separate room makes it very difficult because they follow you anyway. This week I want to talk about why I chose to do a home birth. As a disclaimer, I don't have anything against hospital births, doctors, nurses, any of the medical professionals. I think they do an outstanding job and they deserve to be recognized for their work. I chose a home birth for four specific reasons. The first reason being that I wanted to protect the sacredness, for lack of a better word, of the event. I think home births are sacred. It protects, you know, the whole experience. I think in a hospital, that's more difficult to accomplish. Hey, Bailey. The second reason is that I wanted to, one second, I wanted to have a private birth. I wanted it to be private. I didn't want every, any and everyone to be involved, and I wanted there to be no strangers. The third reason is that I wanted control. I wanted to be able to sit, stand, eat, watch TV, use the bathroom, use my cell phone as I desire, and as, and as we all know, once you check into a hospital, that's it. You lay in that bed and you stay there until you give birth. Well, not all hospitals, but the majority. The fourth reason is because I wanted to remember the childbirth. I didn't want there to be a rushed environment. I feel when you're in the hospital, there's a lot of pressure on you. You have a lot of pressure to take drugs. Uh, there's a lot of med me medical intervention. I wanted it to be very little medical intervention. So those are the reasons why I chose home birth. Thank you so much for watching. See you next week where I will discuss how I chose my midwife. Her name is Laura Hart. Her information will be at the end of this video. Thank you so much for watching. Remember to be bold, be great, and be beautiful.